Hello everybody and welcome to my new weblog video weblog vlog webbing the log captain's vlog the morning after is what we're calling this because it's the morning after Tupos we, we thought about calling it the uh, Tupos hangover video it seems like after such a late night at Tupos I wake up going oh oh man <sighs> That's the Tupos hangover. You don't want to go to class. You don't want to do anything. You're like, hey, I just want to worship God all day. But you have to go to class and you have to go to work. Okay, well, on the vlog, and the purpose of this, of course, is to hit the highlights. It's a vlog. A vlog, the impaler. No, that's not right. That's not that. So we just talked about the Song of Solomon. She says, uh, sweet is the smell of your perfumes. What she's saying is he's a good looking guy. And ladies, I want to hear from you. If you had to choose between a good looking guy and a good smelling guy, which would you choose? Like, what's going to happen there? I don't know. Like, what's it? Do? But then the next line she says is, your name is purified oil. She, she downplays his good looks for his name. And that name for character there is Carasso. It's a metal etching tool which meant you can't wash it away. It's etched into his being. Tidbit. It's a, just a tidbit. Just a little tidbit. You know, it, it talks about the men. Man is kind of like a stag. Woman is kind of like this, uh, this doe. She's jumping away and he's like stagging, you know, after her, trying to find her. You, you gotta make the guy work for it. Don't make it easy on him. She says in verse 7, she says, why should I be as one who veils herself by the flocks of your companion? And you come and tell me where your sheep are, right? So I don't have to go find your friends and be like, hey, where are you? Where's Joey? Where's Joey? Make him, make that stag puff up and come after you. Make him work for you. Don't, don't just, ah, come on. In fact, I suggest that you make him give you a stag resume. I call it a stagame. So men, create a stagame. Women say, I ain't dating you until you give me a stag of May. Yeah, what's that all about? What? What did that happen? Did that, that's what happened? Think about that. <laughs> the top three things to remember from last night. When you got a silhouette in your mind, the kind of person that you won't settle less for. You got your checklists and all that kind of stuff. Two, there, you have a certain things that you will not do to get this guy. I ain't going there, you know. If I got to follow his sheep around, you know, him around like a little hooker. Don't be a hooker. I ain't gonna do that. I don't even necessarily share with them. It's just something that you do, you know, and you have in your mind. It's between you and God. I, there's certain things I ain't gonna do. Number three, you gotta be willing to wait and say in your mind, if I have to wait the rest of my life to get married because I'm waiting for the right kind of one, then I'll do that. And that's where you trust God to take care of it. First vlog, uh, we welcome comments from everybody. Agree, disagree, I don't care. Good conversation going on. I want to know what's out there in the space of cyberness. In the cyberness space, they call it the intranet. Things are floating through the air. Things are happening all the time. Synapses are going off. Um, yeah, in the uh, cavity of the eye, things happen very randomly and, and a lot. Let us know what you think about smell. Min, I suggest you create a stagame. Until next time. Make sure to uh, spade and neuter your cats and dogs January 24th. Now, uh, this is the 25th. I'm still on a tupos hangover.